good day. I'm Sam your EPA's NC2 trainer, I'm going to discuss to you on how to use an analog multimeter or tester. Multimeter is used to test the alternating current voltage, for example the convenience outlet, output of transformer and the AC line. It also used to test the resistance, continuity of wire and circuits. It is used to test the DC current, small amount of current on DC voltage. It is also used to test direct current voltage like battery, converter or charger and used to test electronic components to identify if the component is defective or in good condition. Shown in the picture are parts of the multimeter, the pointer pointing or indicate the value to be read, scale the part where you can read the value, the ohm meter scale voltmeter and the ampere meter, zero position adjuster, used to adjust the pointer going to zero volt, the range selector knob, used for selecting the desired range to be used, test pins the tip of the prod, test probe or prod red is positive and black is negative, zero ohm adjuster knob, used to calibrate the resistance starting to zero before starting to resistance test. Here is the analog multimeter scale the upper scale is for resistance test which is the ohm meter scale from 0 ohm to 2 kilo ohm resistance. Scale 0 to 250 is used for testing AC and DC voltage below 250 volts, scale 0 to 50 is used for testing below 50 volts and 0 to 10 is used for testing below 10V and for the voltage below 1000 volts. How to set the range for resistance reading? The range to be used is times 1, times 10, times 1K and times 10K. In other multi-tester there is times 100 and times 100K you can set the range depends to the resistance value to be test, the range must be lower to the value of the resistance to be test. Example value of a resistor is 1 kilo ohms, the range use must be times 10 or times 100 so that the actual reading in the scale is multiplied to the range used. For testing continuity, you can use times 1 or times 10. On the picture is the scale for resistance reading or the ohm meter scale the reading is from right to left, from 0 to 1 the reading is 0, 0 0.2, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, 0 0.8 and 1. From 1 to 5 the counting is 1, 1 1.2, 1.4, 1 1.6, 1 1.8, and for 2 to 5 the reading is 2, 2.5, 3, 3.5, 4, 4.5, and 5 if the pointer stops in between the number you can read an approximate value, example 2.5 or 1.5, scale 5 to 10 the counting is 5, 5.5, 6, 6.5 up to 10. Reading for 10 to 20 is 10, 11, 12 up to 20 and for 20 to 50, interval of 2, 20, 22, 24, 26, 30 to 50 from 50 to 100, interval of 5, 100 to 200 interval of 20, 100, 100 and 20, 140, 160, 180, 200 for 200 to 500 is 200, 250, 300, 400 and 500 then 1 kilo ohms to 2 kilo ohms. And above is the infinite resistance. How to set the range for ACV alternating current voltage reading. Shown in the above right of the range is for alternating current voltage with the range 10, 50, 200, and 50 and 1000. Range 10 is used for below 10 ACV volts, range 50 for volatga below 50 same as 250 and 1000. Examples of AC volt is the convenience outlet which the current is alternating from positive to negative. Image show is the scale for voltage reading 0 to 10, 0 to 50 and 0 to 250. In the yellow circle is the range for DC ampere or current. It's only used for small value of DC current. In the yellow circle also is the range use when testing battery. The range use must be higher than the voltage to be tested, example you are going to test a 1-2V battery. 
the range will be 50. And the scale to be used is 0 to 50 in the voltmeter scale. Important. Take extra care when testing AC and DC voltage. It may cause electric shock or accident. Use the proper range settings before the test, wrong settings will damage the multi-tester. Always calibrate the multi-tester to get the accurate test reading. Turn off the multi-tester when not in use. Thank you.